Welcome to another Tips and Tricks. Would you like to be notified when input value is not in the expected state? This is important because we want to generate alarm to notify you if a smoke detector is going into alarm, or if there is a low limit in a low temperature condition, or a piece of equipment has failed. To accomplish this, we must go to the Manage dropdown and select Create. Next, we'll go into the Object Type and select Event Enrollment from the drop-down menu. In the object name, we will title the AHU4 Low Limit Alarm. Now, we'll hit the Create button, and the window comes up where we can apply the type of alarm. So we'll go to the alarm type, and from the drop-down menu, select Change of State. In the input field, we'll enter BI7. Note the name change from AHU4 Low Limit, so you can see which unit is in alarm. It's already going to be enabled, so nothing needs to be entered in the Enable field. It automatically becomes active. We'll enter a time delay of 60 seconds. In the Notification class field, I'm going to change that to Critical because it could be a critical type of alarm. Next, we'll need to determine when alarm is generated, so we'll click on Alarm. Once this is accomplished, we'll select Save. And now we'll have created an alarm associated with the low temperature of the equipment. This concludes our tips and tricks for today. Please subscribe to follow us on YouTube. If you liked more content like this, please let us know in the comments below.